The sun shined brightly on the Dawson County Sheriff's Department Tuesday. My wife and I want to give you the $500. And this is how the story ends. So let me tell you how it all began. Jeff and Nancy Fisher contacted CBS 46 for help when they were not receiving payments from the State Department of Labor during the coronavirus pandemic. The Fisher's identity fraud case is resolved. Then my colleague Harry Samler, better known as Better Call Harry, solved the problem and the Fishers received more money than anticipated. My wife and I were touched by a week or two ago. We saw you on television, on news. With the extra cash, they were looking for ways to pay it forward. And then they saw the story of school resource officer Corporal Josh Rogers. Great job. Um, love to watch you play ball. Known around town as Jolly, Officer Rogers honored the class of 2020 by ordering more than 250 yard signs for each student at a cost of $500. It's a simple act of kindness which inspired the Fishers to do something special. And my wife and I had thought about it and I said this officer has gone beyond the, the, the call of duty. He serves and protects this community, but it also made us think about also that you're a representation of the entire department, and that's why we also wanted to come up here today and also recognize the sheriff and the entire department on um, earlier just providing the lunch and just being able to recognize what you mean to the entire community, your officers as a whole. And then I even want us to go back and even recognize even Officer Rogers. But I enjoyed your hospitality today. Well, thank you for uh, one, for what you've done for us. Thank you for what you've done for Officer Jolly. It's, uh, we appreciate, uh, we appreciate it. And it's, we see what Officer Jolly's done for his community, what he means for his community. But it's folks like you that drive our passion too. And uh, uh, unfortunately, we see the, uh, you know, we see the bad side of it oftentimes, but uh, it's refreshing, it's encouraging to know that the folks out there such as you that do have a passion for their law enforcement, but not just that, but having a passion for serving others. I appreciate that. I thank you very much. Well, I enjoyed it again today yeah. as well, and the, um, the, the, your officers that I spoke to, in addition to yourself, just amazing how they uh, love the community that they serve in and that they represent. And uh, what got us here today um, going back to you, Corporal Rogers, one of the things that touched us too, my wife and I, was you mentioned that um, you had uh, said a little act of kindness can go a long way. And I know you directed that at the students in the community that you love, but I think you hit a bigger uh, uh, population, and certainly with my wife and myself. And we felt that uh, that little act of kindness wanted us to come up here today and not only have the lunch, but you also said something else too, that um, you had you had the, the backing of uh, the, the sheriff and the entire department. But you also said something too, that you love these students so much in the community that uh, you know you would spend five hundred dollars of your of your own money, and uh, that is very then that's very touching as well too. But we also thought because you also have two children yourself that my wife and I want to give you the five hundred dollars. <laughs> That you that you laid out. So a little act of kindness does go a long, long way. So the fact that you did all that, that's way beyond. But if my wife and I wanted to give you, my wife Nancy and I felt strongly enough to come up here and give you the five hundred dollars back, so you don't have to think about it. What you did was way beyond for your community. And that's just a little token of our appreciation of everything you do for the for the community here. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Um, is that means a lot um it's uh never imagined that it take off and done what it's done it will be paid forward again forward again in some way somehow no oh, i have no doubt but uh it, it touched us deeply and we just wanted to recognize this today for you you're certainly a great example i think of the department having to talk with the sheriff today many of your fellow officers, and this just seemed the right thing to, right thing to do. So I, I know the communities thank you, but this, this again, thank you very much. I think from everybody who recognizes uh, all first responders, law enforcement, not only during this pandemic we have, but every day. Every day you and your fellow officers go out and serve the community, and that's just amazing. So thank you again. Thank you thank very you. much. That was very generous.